Hello everyone, I'm Roger. This is my green bubble tip anemone, which has doubled its size since it was bought from the local fish store six months ago. It starts to cause damage to SPS corals in its vicinity. That's why the idea of asexual propagation crosses my mind. One morning, I got a chance to take it out of the rock cave. What we need to prepare is as simple as a cut plate and a sharp knife. Make sure, however, that we disinfect the blade with a proper sanitizer. Now that we have the anemone on the cut plate, we're going to plan the fragging. There are two things to note before we move. First, we have to spread out the polyps in order to minimize losses. Second, let's make sure the mouth of the anemone is in the center of its base. This way, we can make the two frags the same size as possible to maximize survival rate of both frags. Now let's get real. Please note that anemones are not like pieces of paper. It's difficult to cut them in half in a single attempt, no matter how sharp your knife is due to them being extremely thick and soft. But multiple wounds will likely increase the chance of bacteria infection. So what we can do is try not to create new wounds. Each time we cut, the blade simply extends at where we stop. Meanwhile, please do not press the anemone too hard as it may hurt its internal organs. Bingo! We are done separating it into two parts. Let's put the two frags back to the bucket as soon as possible. Exposure to air makes them vulnerable. Next, let's witness the miracle of life. Although one looked bigger than the other, both frags survived with healthy growths post-fragging. In fact, a study published in 2014 recorded a survival rate of 89.3% of the anemones cutting half and 62.5% cutting quarters, respectively. It's truly unbelievable, the tenacity of life. For those who suffer from panic attacks in fear of a sudden death, think about this anemone. We are actually capable of so much more than we imagine. The moment we are aware of the cause of panicking and the adversity it brings, death will have lost its grip on us. Let's praise the one who set us free. You have broken every chain. There's salvation in your name. Oh God, you are our living hope. This is my first video on YouTube, hope you guys like it.